Hey y'all, it's your girl C Locked and I'm back with another video. So in this video, we're going to be talking about how to take care of your locks in the winter time because we know winter is on its way. Actually, the weather is pretty much here, but winter is on its way. So I want to give you guys a few tips on how to take care of your locks in the winter time. So before we get started on this video, yes, I did dye my locks. I dyed the bottom half black. I just wanted something different but everything else is still the same. I was gonna touch up my roots, but I was like, I'm not bleaching my hair no more, so I'm just gonna let my roots do what they do. But yes, I did. Let's look at this. Well, I mean, you can't really see the length because of the black, but it's sitting right here, baby. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So my first tip is, I know you guys love to wear like um, hoodies, sweaters, and stuff like that. I would say to wear hoodies and sweaters with minimum lint. There's a lot of, you know, different materials that don't have lint that comes with it because we all know that lint is very attracted with our locks and it's very hard to come out of our locks once it gets embedded in your locks. So I would say wear like a hoodie or um, a jacket that doesn't have so much lint in it. The next tip is to dry brush. So a lot of people don't know this, but yes, you can brush your locks, it's very beneficial. There's dry brushing and there's wet brushing. So dry brushing, you uh, take a soft brish bristle brush and you brush your locks, you know, as soft as you can to get whatever that's sitting on top of your locks out of your locks, such as lint, fur, anything like that. So if you wear jackets that have fur or some type of lint on it, I would say to dry brush your locks every night especially in the back the back is the one the area that gets so much lint on it so like anytime that you get home at night before going to bed i would say dry brush your locks just to make sure that you're taking the lint out because once it's embedded in your locks it's so difficult to get out and it's very damaging to our locks to like pick it out once it's already in there next tip is i know that people like to wear scarves under their jacket so i would say if you could find a scarf that is satin material that would really help your locks because we all know that cotton and other materials do dry our locks out and the winter time is already drying and harsh to our hair so i would say try to find something with a soft material such as satin or silk or something like that to wear under your jacket or under your hoodie or however it is that you wear your scarf so really just be mindful like if you're winter shopping for clothes and you have locks be mindful of the material of clothes that you are shopping for because we do want to take care of our babies and the weather is already harsh so we don't want to be harsh to our babes already added on to the harshness that's already going to go on <laughs> so the next tip is a lot of people don't like to blow dry their locks but i feel like at a certain length especially and certain seasons we have to blow dry our locks because when your locks are longer you get a mildewy smell if it doesn't dry all the way and my locks are not even like super long and it already takes like a while to dry especially if it's cold outside so i do blow dry my locks if i'm washing my locks or like you know in that type of area where if you're washing your locks i would say blow dry them for at least 30 minutes so that you don't get a mildewy mold in your locks because yes you can get mold in your locks mold grows in dark wet places and inside of our locks is dark and if it's still wet from you washing it and it's not being fully dry it can get mold in it so definitely blow dry your locks for at least 30 minutes before you go to bed so that way you're not going to bed with wet locks the next tip would be to be mindful when you wash your hair so if you feel like washing your locks and you really don't want to blow dry them because you're against blow drying I would say wash your hair as early as you can so therefore you have all day to wash your hair and i know like in the winter time it's still there's still sun outside so just like if you want to you can sit outside and let the sun hit your locks a little bit but try not to wash your hair at night if you know you're not gonna blow dry it because that's literally one of the worst things you can do to your locks it's just the smell just everything is a no and plus you don't want to get a head cold because it's already winter and you're washing your hair at night and you know at night is when it's the coldest because there's no sun so just try to be mindful of when you do wash your locks the next tip would be if you're a person who lives in harsh weather in the winter time 
try your best to cover your locks because literally just think about it like when you plant a plant during the summer it thrives and it does well but if the plant is outside during the winter time it literally dies so we just want to protect our locks during harsh winter weathers because not to say your locks are going to die but they're going to be so 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 dry so if you are a type of person that can wear like a satin scarf around your hair if you're going shopping or something and you could wear something in your hair to cover it from this harsh weather then you could do that but if not just try to moisturize it as much as you can when you do get home because moisture we have to keep our locks moisturized so one thing about the winter time is when i moisturize my locks I don't like using anything cold so what i do is i put like warm water in a um spray bottle and i moisturize my locks that way or i'll use like a leave-in conditioner type of spray because those sprays are very water-based because i don't want cold water in my scalp and i have to be outside and it's already cold i just feel like it doesn't mix so you can use warm water to moisturize your locks or you can use anything you know that's already around the house to moisturize your locks but just make sure and keep in mind to moisturize them more than you would during the summertime because of course the weather is more dry my last tip for you guys is to drink a lot of water the way you take care of your locks from the outside is the same way you have to take care of them from the inside drinking a lot of water brings shine to your locks your locks and everything stays flourished and everything like that so just try to drink as much water as you can during this winter vacation just to keep every even for your skin like because um i know a lot of people their skin start acting up around the winter time just drink as much water as you can and i feel like that would definitely help with your locks and everything else so thank you guys so much for watching this video if you have any questions concerns or anything that you want to add to this video please leave it in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if this is your vibe. And also don't forget to check the description box. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you in my next one.